Fog and blinding snow can obscure the view from the top of a ski mountain, but a good pair of ski goggles can add some clarity to the situation. They shield the eyes from the elements, and certain lenses add contrast in low light to allow the skier to see the bumps and dips ahead. Goggle lenses come in different tints to adjust for specific weather scenarios. They start with this injection molding machine. The operator sprays a non-stick substance into the mold and closes the door. The machine sucks up urethane pellets, then melts them into a thick liquid to mold into goggle frames. It takes just seconds for the shape to harden. A worker clips away unwanted bits, and then he's ready to give these goggles a more graphic look. He immerses the cellophane-like film, printed side down, in a mix of water and solvent. A chemical reaction lifts the graphic design off the film and suspends it in the liquid. He sprays solvent on the other side to both activate a bonding agent and dissolve the film. He then immerses a rack of goggle frames in the floating graphic. The surface tension of the water causes the graphic pattern to wrap around the frames, and the bonding agent makes it stick. This technique is called hydrographics, and it's a good way to transfer a pattern onto a three-dimensional surface. He washes away any paint or dirt from the surface of the frames. A clear lacquer is the finishing touch. For an understated look, there's always monochromatic white. A worker applies glue around the vents of a pair, then presses foam onto them. The foam will keep snow out of the goggles, but allow air to be vented to prevent fogging. He applies thicker foam around the perimeter for a weather-tight fit on the skier's face. Once the straps are installed, the goggles are ready for the latest innovation, a microelectronic fan. It will pull warm, humid air out of the goggles to further prevent fogging. He screws the mini fan to the frames and listens to its spin to confirm it's operating correctly. Next, a machine cuts shapes out of polycarbonate to make lenses. Then the special press applies heat to bend the lens. This shape will make it easier to secure the lens to the frame, and it also reduces optical distortion. Production now moves to this liner-backed foam with pre-cut lens patterns. The worker peels off a strip to expose a goggle-shaped strip of foam. She then presses a colored lens onto the strip. High-strength adhesive on the foam bonds to the lens. She pulls away the rest of the material, leaving that narrow ribbon of foam. It will serve as a spacer between the outer colored lens and an inner clear one. The space between the two lenses is a buffer zone to prevent condensation buildup and fogging. Now they shoot a steel pellet at a randomly selected pair of goggles. It doesn't shatter, which means it will effectively shield the skier's eyes from sharp objects like tree branches and ski poles. It's time to snap the dual layer lens into the frame's molded groove. A UV mirror coating has also been applied to protect the eyes from the sun's rays and reduce glare. These goggles have everything covered, leaving the skier free to focus on the thrill of the ride.